He tried all sorts of tricks, but it was no good. His driver checked him every time. Oh dear, he thought sadly, I'll never get there. One day he pulled the express to the station as usual. His fireman uncoupled the coaches and he ran onto his siding to wait till it was time to go home. The coaches waited and waited at the platform, but their engine didn't come. A porter ran across and spoke to Gordon's driver. The inspector's on the platform. He wants to see you. The driver climbed down from the cab and walked over the station. He came back in a few minutes looking excited. Hello, said the fireman, what's happened? The engine for the express turned over when it was coming out of the yard. Nothing else can come in or out. They want us to take the train to London. I said we would if the fat controller agreed. They telephoned and he said we could do it. How's that? Fine, said the fireman. We'll show them what the fat controller's engines can do. Come on, said Gordon. Let's go. He rolled quickly over the crossings and backed onto the train. It was only a few minutes before the guard blew his whistle, but Gordon thought it was ages. Gordon! big engine had to work harder than ever before. Come on, he called to the coaches. Come on, come on, come on. The passengers rely on me to be on time. We're going to town. We're going to town, sang the coaches slowly at first, then faster and faster. 